Martin Luther King once said, on some positions, cowardice asks the question, is it safe? Expediency asks the question, is it politic? Vanity comes along and asks the question, is it popular? The conscience asks the question, is it right? And there comes a time when one must take the position that is neither safe, nor politic, nor popular, but he must do it because conscience tells him it's right. Several weeks ago, Delaware General Assembly introduced and passed House Bill 425. This was an answer to an opinion that was given by the Delaware Attorney General's Office in relation to House Bill 245 that threatened to take the Constitution Party off of the ballot in November. We still have a problem with having ballot access. Due to House Bill 245 being signed into law in February, several members of the Constitution Party had changed their affiliation before the deadline of the closed primary season in March of 2010. Due to this, we must obtain 50 additional members for the Constitution Party, or else we will not have ballot access. July 13th, was the deadline for individuals to run on either of the two major parties as a candidate. I decided not to do this. However, I have decided to fill out forms to run as a fusion candidate on the Independent Party of Delaware. In the event that the Constitution Party is not able to obtain ballot access in November, by being accepted as the Independent Party of Delaware's fusion candidate, it would still give voters the ability to vote for me in November to represent them in Washington, D.C. as their, their Congress. On July 30th, the Constitution Party will hold a convention. This convention will be at Bogies in Middletown from 7 p.m. until 10 p.m. For more information, you can go to theconstitutionparty.com, go to the state's link that's at the top of the page, look at Delaware, and you will find all of the information as well as a map on how to get to Bogies in Middletown. You will also be able to find it on my website at ershawgpen.com, ershawgpen.com, or welcome for Congress. If you have a Facebook page, you can look for me on Facebook. I post many publishings on Facebook as well, and much of the information you'll also find on Facebook. Thank you. Good evening.